What's going on everybody? Welcome for the first time or back to another DLJ Works video. And what we're going to talk about today's video is how I'm actually selling appointments, consultations, 60 minute consultations for Vimeo OTT and Uscreen services. And this is actually going to be a little bit cheaper than just trying to hire me to do your entire platform, to do somebody's entire platform. When I say your I'm talking about potential clients, people who actually need assistance services. And sometimes you don't really need full on uh, setup. You don't need full on setup. You just kind of need to be guided. You kind of just need your hand held a little bit. Customers just kind of need that. So that's what this video is just kind of all about right now. And what are you going to get out of a 60 minute consultation? What are you going to get out of this particular service? Well, a couple of things that I actually want to show you is that uh, one, I'm actually able to do this through Gumroad, and I'm gonna actually make another video for that. So at the end of this video, be make sure to stay tuned so you can learn how to actually sell your own consultations and appointments using Gumroad. But this is also gonna be in combination with Calendly. Now, count if I said that right, Calend.ly actually has the option if you upgrade to their professional services to be able to get integrations, to be able to get payment integrations. We take a look right um, there right now calend.ly and we look at their pricing okay we can see that if we go down to integrations where we actually need to connect payments with stripes and paypal that is going to come at the twelve dollars a month or this is actually billed annually so it's going to be a little bit cheaper but let's look at this fifteen dollars per month so it's going to come out in that much money if you're trying to have some sort of payment integrations when you're accepting appointments. Where if you want to stay on the free plan in order to make that happen, then you can actually use Gumroad to do so. But that's not what this video is going to be about right now at this moment. We'll talk about that in the next video that's going to come up after this one. So what is this for? What are you going to get out of a Vimeo OTT and Uscreen consultation? Um, you'll be able to ask whatever questions that you want to like you'll be able to get live and direct troubleshooting or customization via zoom so this isn't you paying me by the hour this is you being on the actual zoom call or phone call with me or whatever the case may be however we're going to agree to communicate preferably zoom so you can see my face and I'll be able to share a screen show you certain things be able to teach you how to use your website You'll be able to do a lot of things just on that single 60 minute phone call. Now, you'll also be able to get some live coding from me. Maybe there's some, maybe you need some text change on your homepage or something on your like Vimeo OTT and you need some CSS done or there's a section you want added to your use screen. Well, just a simple consultation, you'll be able to try, you'll be able to afford and, and accomplish that without having to sit up here and pay me some sort of relay fee to be able to to do that you don't have to sit up here and pay the development setup all right um trying to charge you 300 dollars or so to get this actually done but you may actually get a consultation with me to try to achieve that solution within the um an initial 60 minutes you know and right now i'm going my going rate has to increase because of inflation because the amount of requests that i'm actually getting now and i'm hoping that people will just go ahead and either get my diy kit if you're using Uscreen, $24.99, Vimeo TT, $14.99, or we just stick with the consultations. This is a last resort, all right? Because uh, if I must do it, then it's going to cost quite a bit of penny because it takes a lot of time off of my books, and there's a lot of things that needs to go into the planning and setup. So you're going to get a lot of bang for your buck with this $5,000 cost that you see here. But if um if that's something you can't afford, then that's something that you don't need to worry about. But that's for somebody that does not have the time to set up their own platform and they don't mind making the investment. All right. I want to use that word clearly. You're making an investment if you're paying somebody such as myself to develop your site for you. That's going into graphics, that's going into the actual some coding aspects, that's going into some content planning, that's going into communication back and forth. I actually have a customer that I'm working with where he's getting that experience right now and it's been a blessing for both uh, himself and myself as well. So um, some other things, let's get back to this though. You'll be able to get unique content marketing strategies for your platform. So you may be running a course platform or educational course type of platform there's some there's some unique things that you can actually do to bring more members onto your platform to actually 
gain new customers how you're going to serve those recurring customers those are things we actually need to talk about and how that plays into your role when using a platform such as vimeo tt or uscreen you need content strategies audience building youtube incorporations because you know i've been on youtube for quite some time with dlj works and making tutorial videos making these educational videos so how do you play that into beginning to build a streaming service you want to make the streaming service worth your customers time and worth their little 4.99 investment per month because here's the thing i look at this always and i'm like okay now you have these streaming services pop up such as vimeo tt and uscreen that's going to be more noise and that's just another thing that's just pulling your attention away from the things that matters the most for your customers so what reason are they going to have to pay your platform 4.99 for your content how are you going to pull them in and that's where using tools as a top of the marketing funnel such as youtube comes in because you'll be able to actually you'll be able to engage your people you'll be you'll, you'll begin to build that that audience rapport early off off of your membership site and people once they actually become emotionally invested into what you're making and, and how you're doing it, and they feel like they have a connection with you even though it's not it's a very pseudo connection I'm not going to say it's a real connection. It's very pseudo because you don't know these people. They don't really know you, but they're going to feel like they know you, but it's very pseudo. So, but the thing is, is that you can still get people emotionally invested into the work that you're actually doing and putting in when it comes to this. So, and uh, whatever else you can get squeezed into that time frame. So sky's the limit when you're doing a consultation is going to actually be a lot cheaper when compared to doing this setup and trying to find somebody to actually pay and actually like i said this is for people who are very serious about their platform and they're looking to outsource the work that needs to be done rather than them trying to do it themselves but if you're just trying to do some basic setup you're just trying to you know put your content up put up some basic graphics do some metadata for your content get the diy course just get that that's going to be your cheapest option available right now but consultations i would encourage you to either do a consultation or just get the DIY course, which is going to answer your questions in a nutshell. This is, like I said, this is a very much so last resort. So, uh-oh, it went too far. Now, let me be very clear about consultations. You're paying for the time. Whatever happens in that time frame is just what happens in that time frame. I make no guarantees that a solution is going to be found when you're actually booking that consultation. But we will work and when you book the consultation with me for that hour or however long you're going to do it, we're going to work towards trying to get to the solution as best as we possibly can. If there's some unanswered questions, there's just questions that's just going to be unanswered. And another session is going to have to be booked or more hours or whatever else. However else you feel like you want to get to the solution, book the number of hours that you feel like is necessary. But you're paying for the time, not the actual content, not the actual context. So... I put a disclaimer inside of my, let me see if I can find my website, where is it at? I put a disclaimer inside here just letting you know that payment for consultations are based on time and time alone. Payment is not based on content or context of said meeting. Client is responsible for any questions asked, etc. to ensure they achieve the desired use of their time. DLT Works will strive to provide requested information but makes no guarantees that a solution will be reached in one scheduled meeting all right so the consultation is only for the time if you get any questions that are unanswered or we're not able to actually solve and reach a solution it is what it is that you're you're not paying for that you're not paying for oh well i'm only paying this hundred dollars if i get a guaranteed solution no 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 we're paying you're only paying for the time that is actually booked so uh we may do a little 15 minute grace period for some introductions for some ancillary small talk but for the most part you're only paying for the time not the content within that time frame or anything else all right so if you need to book um, a whole number of hours you know if you need to book six hours six hundred dollars if you need to book three hours you know we'll do that now once you actually book this i've already did a, a tested purchase on this to kind of show you what this looks like an email in the, in the form of this is going to be sent to your inbox You'll be given a button and it's actually going to do a countdown or it's going to open up a new screen here and it's going to begin a countdown or where it's going to redirect you to the calendarly scheduling appointment so you'll be able to see when i'm available so if we go to book your meeting also before we do that you can also see that you had an option to generate an invoice for your records so that's going to be good for you 
So we go to book your meeting. It's going to take you right here to Calendarly right, right now. And then you'll be able to book the times that's actually necessary. So I don't, I don't do Sundays um, unless it's just an urgent or, or an emergency, emergency sort of situation. You know, Sundays are church and family. But for the most part, you can see that um, and during the day I work as a teacher. But afterwards, we have from 8 to 11 p.m. Um, it stops at 10 p.m. So I would go, you know, well, it stops at 10 p.m. for the right reason, because it's only the, the cap time is at 11 o'clock. All right. So at nighttime and then on Saturdays, we have from 9 a.m. to where it stops at 3 o'clock. So from 9 to 3 p.m. on Saturdays is when we can actually book consultation time and try to get your problem solved as best as possible for these platforms. Maybe it's a simple question that you need to ask, wherever the case may be. But from here on out, everybody will be redirected to the, um, what should I say here? Everybody will be redirected to the Calendarly or the um, the Gumroad link. So you can book an actual session and you can actually go ahead and just go from there. And we could also go into talks and all those other things. So that's going to be it for this particular video. I just wanted to kind of shed some light on what the consultations are going to look like and the services that I'm offering for this and what those look like. So the next thing that you should actually do right now at this moment is to make sure that you watch the video. If you're interested, teach you how to use Gumroad to sell your own appointment times or consultations for your particular audience. So that way you don't have to try to do this all via conversations on email. Somebody tries to ask you a question. Hey, book a consultation with me. Here's the link so you can do so. Buy some hours or whatnot. Somebody's still sending you emails or sending you comments or whatnot. Book a consultation with me. Go to Gumroad. Here goes purchase some hours. Let's set aside some time. Book it on Calendly. Let's go. Let's do that. That's what the next video is going to teach you. So if you're interested in that, go ahead and click on the next video and I will see you there. God bless you.